When I first worked with Carla, or I should say when Remy first met Christina, he was late to the MCATs. He was too busy saving Olivia's life. <laughs> no, he was late. He was unsure whether he wanted to take the test because, you know, if he goes there, then the pressure of having to grow up, the pressure of having to be mature and responsible is there. And it's so much easier just to sit back and let life fly by. But he takes the test and when he meets Christina, it's like, a testament to how he just doesn't belong here <laughs> and how he's not going to do well. He's not confident and he meets someone who's not only confident, is focused and is like loving the challenge. Like, like it's fun for her to take this test. But she, she definitely made him feel at ease, you know, very warm and welcoming. So that helped him. But seeing her was like seeing the person that he'll never be or wished he could be. So it's an, it's an interesting dynamic. Christina is a very hard worker. She's ambitious. She really cares about people. She wants to do good in the world, and she's always wanted to be a doctor. And when I meet Remy, he's late for the test. And I cannot believe that someone, I mean, it's just so opposite for me. I'm sure that I got up at five o'clock in the morning, ran three miles, took a practice test, you know, and cooked dinner for like an entire soup kitchen before showing up five minutes, you know, 50 minutes early. And this fool <laughs> runs in <laughs> at the last minute, like, oh, is there a test today? So um, that's how we meet. But even though I am shocked, I am also completely, blown away by his charm and wit and dashing good looks. Well, you know, when Remy saw Christina, it was like Ava who? No, joking. <laughs>